All right, I mean, that was a 40 inch muskie probably. Got one. Probably muskies, let's see. Oh, I lost it. That was a muskie. What is up guys, welcome back to another episode. Today is some May 20th, I don't, know. I don't even, it's May 20th probably, something like that. Today, as you can see, it is absolutely pouring. We're getting pissed on with rain right now, and uh, we're going for a very special fish today. Also known as the fish of 10,000 casts. That's right, it's a muskie. I haven't caught a muskie in like five years, so you know, I'm really gonna try and get another one. I've done many trips in the pa past five years to try and catch them. Lost a bunch, you know, saw them, had follows, no success whatsoever. So today, hopefully that's going to change. Of course, the conditions are absolutely horrible, but those are the times when you catch the big fish. You know, today, if we catch a muskie in these conditions, absolutely epic. So, um, 
you know, we, we just have shiners on um, thick leader on the bobbers. There's no use in throwing lures. There's a cold front. Um, these fish are going to be a little bit lazier today. So we're just going to throw bait out, um, like li large shiners and under. Oh, man, it's really starting to come down now. Hopefully we can get something. Um, I'm going to keep this nice and short, but I want to show you the guy who's going to help me catch him. This is Josh right here. You guys saw him in my ice fishing video and um, one of my lost footage episodes. This guy knows what he's doing. He's going to help me catch fish. So um, make sure to go check out his channel, Pocono Outdoors Guy. Of course, I'll leave a link in the description and all that, all that good stuff. So make sure to go show him some love because if I catch a muskie today, it's on his advice. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. It's going to be great. Hope you guys knew this video. All right, guys, so you got a setup here. We got a net ready in case you get a fish. We got a rod right there, bait feeder, um, bobber, slip bobber to shiner. Another rod here, another two down there. All ready in case a muskie comes by and crushes our bait. We got Josh here trying to catch a perch with a, a bill of shiner. Oh, wait. Did my bobber just go down? I don't know. <laughs> my, my line just started moving. It so I, th I think it did. Huh, well, try and catch that perch. <laughs> no, um, yeah. Uh, I'd say four inches. Oh, really? Yeah, so that one you caught before is. No. Oh, that was a yeah, that was like yellow. <laughs> Yeah. Have you ever caught a golden shiner here? Here, no. So you caught him somewhere else? Yeah. No! What? Stay down! Stay down! What the heck? Again, yeah. No! Dang it! <laughs> the close one, yeah. Ah! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, um, sure how long do you let it eat for? Uh, just... don't, it's a small shiner. You don't okay. have to wait long. There you go, man. Uh, on? No? Nope. Off? It, was, it was a bass or something tiny. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, there's a few of them out here. Did you stick them or just came out? I didn't feel a stick. Okay. It, it had to be something small. Yeah, yeah. That's probably what was messing with mine. Yep. A pickerel. There's a pickerel sitting right here. Come back. What the heck? It jumped out of the water for it. No way. There's a, it's a baby pickerel. might even be a... What the heck? Where'd it go? That was... Okay. That was, in, that was actually, like, insane. <laughs> uh, what? It's like a, t it's like a 10-inch pickerel. This leap... He le As I brought it up, he leaped out of the water and grabbed it. What? I mean, it could have been a baby musky. It was orangish. Oh, no, it's under. Oh, no, let's back up. Wonder what that was. Yeah. What the heck? Dang it. <laughs> Why you gotta play with my heartstrings, man? Well, that sucks. Well, that sucks. <laughs> yeah. Just gonna leave it. Cause at first my bobber wasn't moving, but my line started to shoot out. I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, my line started to shoot at first, and since I'm using a slip bobber, that's why. Yep. And I was like, my just went down, dude. Oh really? Yeah, that one out there just went down. Huh? Yeah, it's going back up. We're getting we're getting messed with right now. What the heck? I don't have anything to dry to wipe the sponge off with. Yeah, me, me neither. I'm, I mean, I'm soaked. I literally don't have a dry spot on my body. Me neither. You know what? I feel like it's going to happen. Something's yeah. going something's gonna to happen. Okay. Fish. On. Musky. Ah! Oh. <laughs> yes! I told you, man! I told you! Oh, look how hungry. I told you, man! You did, sir. Is it like a big one or what? It's decent.
It's not very big. It's a star. It ain't small to do that. Yeah. A big old wake. That is a huge one. That's a fork. Uh, it's not probably not gonna fit in this one. Yeah. I mean, do you want you don't mind getting dirty for it, right? Try to snag. I'll, I'm, I'll, I'll walk out there for it. Me too, buddy. I'll get you. I'll, I will not do anything to not use this fish. That's not a bad fish. Here, like... I'm going to take, take my everything out of my pocket. It's valuable. I'm going in, not you. You guys shoot the line tight. Okay. Oh, he's just in weeds. Huh? Just in weeds. Is it coming through? Yeah. I don't know if this net is a good option or not. Fish is still there, right? It's a really good one. There you go, man. Not a bad fish. I don't know if it's 40, it's not 40. but it's high 30. It's a musky, yeah. Yep. Chill, chill, chill. Good stuff, dude. That's cool. Okay, let's uh, let's sort this guy out. Um, I'm not gonna lift it out of the water in this net. Yes. This type of net hurts them. Yes, yes. Um, let's get the hook out, and then I'll just pick him up. Yep, I'll take. I'll just hold the net so you can work. Much better. Actually, it might have, could have come off. Oh my god, my hands are shaking so I can't really <laughs> grab it. And these are pretty cool. small forceps too. It's out, dude. All right, so, you know how to grab these things. Okay, I mean, could you, I think you could try, it's probably too wet. Could you at least try and get course, a picture? All right, guys, so just caught this musky. This is my first one in a few years. Not a bad size, pretty heavy. Let's get a release on him. Just turn her so she's out facing the deep water. There you go. It's such a chunky thing. They've really been girthing up, haven't they? Yeah. I'm sure there's something that stuffs. Come on, come on, girl. They take a minute sometimes, you know, they tire themselves oh, do they, out. Do they kick off real strong too? Uh, sometimes. The smaller ones, they're just like pickerel, they sort of jump off. Sometimes the big ones will just kind of sink to the bottom for a minute and then take off. Okay, but if you just hold her there for a while, Sorry. she'll probably go. Starting to feel somewhere. Oh, yeah, kicking a little bit. Oh, there it goes a little bit. Not going to let her go just yet. Just until I feel that strong. A little bit more, come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. A little bit more. Almost ready. Yeah. Oh, dude, that was a good release, too. Yep. Lit. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not. That's such a chunky fish. They've really been girthing up, haven't they? Yeah. I'm sure there's something in that stomach. Oh, come on, bud. Come on, girl. They take a minute sometimes. Yeah. You know, they tire oh, I, out. Do they kick off real strong, too? Is it, sometimes, my smaller ones, they were just like pickerel, they just sort of darted off. Sometimes the big ones will just kind of sink to the bottom for a minute, and then take off. Okay, but she's starting to- just hold her there for a while, starting to probably go. Starting to feel some life. Oh, yeah, it's kicking a little bit. Oh, there it goes a little bit. I'm not gonna let her go just yet, just until I feel that strong. A little bit more, come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. A little bit more. Almost ready. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, dude, that was a good release too. Yep. Lit. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that's not bad. That's a good start for the day. Hopefully, we can get more. <sighs> thanks for uh, thanks for grabbing it. That was good. On the on the Ponce's bait feeder. Alright guys, so this is the end of the day. As you saw, I got that muskie. Um, really awesome. Um, I'm really happy. It was a great day. Didn't have any more fish after that, just had a bunch of fish playing with us for the rest of the day, but it doesn't matter, I caught a muskie, that's all that matters. So, big thanks to this guy for helping me get a muskie, he wanted to help me get one today, so he's, he feels accomplished, I feel accomplished, it was a great day. That was my number one goal, I just had to see you get one, it was so good. Yep, I can't wait to, I mean I haven't seen the footage yet really, I can't wait to go home, check it out, and post this up for you guys, because I'm sure you'll enjoy it. 
Hope you guys enjoyed this Quick video. Question. Oh wait, Yanni or Laurel? Oh no, <laughs> I tried to stay away from that <laughs> <Just> video. <laughs> All right, guys. So please make sure to go give him some love. Go subscribe to his channel, Pokemon Outdoors Guy. I'll leave a thing. There's gonna be a card again. Um, a link in the description. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys later.